Hi friends! Crystal Kingsley here from Sunview Studio and I just wanted to say thank you for your purchase and all your support. The landscape series is a huge success and as part of our promotional I offered a kids free drawing lesson and so that's this video for you today. We're gonna read Little Blue Truck Leads the Way and then we're gonna create an awesome illustration. If you're welcome to share this with any friends or family who love to draw, if you love the video personally, consider liking and subscribing and sharing. Uh, thanks again for all your support and I hope you have fun with me drawing today. I'm going to read you the book, Little Blue Truck Leads the Way. He's our inspiration for our next drawing project. The horn went beep, engine purred, friendliest sounds you've ever heard. Little blue truck rolled into the city, beep, 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 isn't it pretty? Towering buildings scraped the sky, beep said blue, the city is high. Zoom rode the trucks down the avenue, the city is fast said Little Blue. Shove on, Shorty, yelled the double-decker bus with big red letters. Rides are us. The grocery truck gave his horn a blast. Move it, bud. I'm first. You're last. Woo-wee! Went a siren coming through. Busy police car. Things to do. Swish, swash, swoosh. Went a big street sweeper. Hollering, hey, better move, little beeper. Make way, all the limousine, the longest car you've ever seen. I've got his honor, the mayor inside. I'm important, move aside. Cars and trucks were all in a tangle. Everyone started to shout and wrangle. Upward a taxi, screech went the brakes. Stop, yelled Blue, for goodness sakes. You might be fast and I might be slow, but one at a time is the way to go. Me first, said the limo, all puffed with pride. Then he gave a cough and his engine died. He was stuck right there with the mayor inside. Beep, said Blue. Would you like a ride? Everybody watched, watching gave a shout when the door swung open and the mayor stopped out. His honor climbed up right up on Blue and gave a speech the way mayors do. My friends, he said, what wonderful luck. This good advice from a little blue truck. One at a time is what we'll do. So f single file, folks, follow Blue. Trucks and buses got in a line with vans and taxis. It all went fine. A taxi let a van go past. The double-decker bus said, I'll go last. A marching band joined the big parade. Boom went the drums and the trumpets played. They rolled along the avenue and everyone waved to Little Blue. They clapped their hands and yelled hooray for the Little Blue truck who led the way. What you do is grab a pencil or a marker, anything you want to draw with, I recommend black marker is great, but whatever you have available is what I want you to use. I'm going to teach you step by step. Cohen and I are going to draw together to teach you. Okay. The very first thing we're going to do is we're going to take and we're going to make a long, narrow rectangle. It's going to actually have a C on each side, and then you're going to connect across. Very nice, okay. Now we're gonna add a wide U on each side outside of your original rectangle. And in the middle, we're gonna make a tall, skinny rectangle right in the middle. Looks like an upside down letter T. On the top of that rectangle, we're gonna add a rainbow a small V, with a topper, 
Now these big U's are going to swoop and curve and touch where it connects. Swoop and curve and touch. The same thing's gonna happen on top. Curve and touch. Notice how it goes from fat to skinny. It's a tapered line. Okay, little blue's coming right along. We're gonna add two bolts for the little details on the front of his truck. We're going to come in and we're gonna add the wheels. So we're gonna come down and curve in and go invisible line to the top. That's one wheel. Same thing's gonna happen on the other side. We're gonna come down, curve in, and come up and touch. Now we've got both wheels done. Okay, on top of little blue, on the side of each of the rainbow piece, we're gonna come out with a V shape on top. I wanna make sure they're pretty close to even. We're gonna connect across. And then we're gonna bring the line straight down. Very nice, friends. Okay, on top, we're going to add a rectangle coming up, sitting right on top of that V. We're gonna add a very skinny long rectangle across the top. It sticks out a little on each side. And a rainbow on top of that for the roof. In the middle of the windshield here, we're gonna do a double line right down the center. We're gonna rectangle around Once you do one side, you're going to do the other side too. Okay, we're ready for the back. Well, let's do the mirrors. So they look like lollipops. Double line with a circle. Same thing on the other side. Double line with a circle. And then blue, we can see that he's got a front part, but he also has the back where you can see his tires. So we actually have a line that comes out over here and then makes a curve down. And we're gonna do the same thing on both sides. Out and curve. And these are where his back wheels are because he has a bed to his truck. Now we're gonna take from that curve, we're gonna come not right on the end, but a little ways in, and we're gonna come straight down. Just a little tiny bit in from that end and come straight down. Okay, now Blue needs some of his special details. We're gonna have some stripes going through this long rectangle. Space them out evenly. I think I can fit four. You might be able to fit two or three. In our practice drawing, Cohen only fit one and it looked just great. So I'm sure however many you can fit in will be perfect. Okay, now in the story, Oh, we gotta get his back tires. So we've got little tiny curves that come in here. One, make sure they're the same length or shorter than your front tires. Two, so we've got the wheels going in, the front wheels and the back wheels. And in the story, Blue's carrying some cargo. It's like rolled up grass or sod. Because it's spring, we're gonna make ours with flowers. So we're gonna have a rectangle that sits on top of each of these wheel wells. And we're going to make some bumpy lines for grass. And because it's spring, Cohen and I decided we were going to add some flowers. We're going to go with the circle bump, bump, bump flowers, like a daisy. And they can sit on top of your grass or in your grass. You can decide if you want a lot of flowers or a few flowers. You could also decide if you want something other than flowers. You don't have to do flowers. So we've got the boxes on the sides, and Blue has a very big box on top. It goes up and rectangles over and comes back down. This one we're going to put 
bumpy cloud line for the graphs. And we're going to add a rope. It's going to tie onto the graph. So it's going to be double line down, stripe across, double loop, one, and an inside loop for two. Double loop going the other way. And again, the lines across to make it look like a rope. And of course, you want the little tails. I'm going to put mine down here. Double line, line across. I'm going to add my little flowers. And you can do this or you can leave them out. It's up to you. One more, maybe. I think that's good. Okay, so now that we look, we realize that we need to do the eyes for a little blue. So we're going to do medium circles with a smaller circle inside of it and a third circle. The other detail I'd like is um, they're actually like wooden crates on his back. So I'm going to put the stripes in to show that they look wooden on just the flower planters. And then the last thing we're going to add is you can decide if you want blue to have eyebrows. You can do, I, we did a couple different ones. You can do kind of the normal ones we see in the book or Cohen did a couple different ones in his practice drawing. He did the outside kind of concerned eyebrows or sad eyebrows. And he also did one with angry eyebrows. You can see they're going on an angle like in this on the inside. So you can decide which kind of eyebrows you'd like to have. I'm just going to go with neutral eyebrows. So that's our car blue. And now it's time to color.